Hey, what's going on, YouTube? Glad you guys were able to make it with us once again. Ah, bro code. For that bro code. Bam. Now, as you've seen in the title, we man, we just going to get straight to it. Yes. But, you know, if y'all ain't seen it, you know, of course, you know. Everybody's seen it, but. Yeah, you got to let them right. know, let roll a <laughs> Unless you've lived under a rock all your life. Yeah, you I know, know you've seen this video <laughs> of the river, riverboat uh, Bro, incident yes, brawl yes. in Alabama. Yes, here you go. Those guys who parked there were told not to leave it there, and they left it there. All right, bro. So, uh, damn, there's a lot that can be said about this uh, this incident right here. One of the things, and and which is is probably the most obvious, mm -hmm. is the fact that um, <sighs> white privilege. Oh yeah, automatically. You know, no, we don't have to move. We're gonna stay here, and you guys are gonna wait for us to move. Right. And then you can move that big ass riverboat over here. <laughs> <laughs> you know, and then let those niggers off. You Man. know? But, uh, but basically, I mean, yeah. Yes. Now when the brother go over there, he worked for the um that area, whatever that area is uh, as a security. Well he was a doc person. You yes. know what I mean? He was just letting them know, hey, you know, you guys got to move or whatever because this spot is reserved for the riverboats. So right. Basically. And then, hey, to get attacked the way that he did. Now, okay, I seen, okay, one person. Okay. Mm -hmm. But now now the dude come from out of out of, out of uh, 9 o'clock and just go ahead and clock on 3 o'clock. Even now, the women jumped in, bro. Yeah, man. I was like, you know what? I was like, oh, hell no. Nah. And so... When I seen the brothers coming, when I seen the first brother coming, I was like, okay, cool, yeah. cool. He finna, he finna, he finna get at somebody. But he didn't. No, what he did was he was getting them off, yeah. uh, off, off the guy, which, which was great. Yeah, which you know, was and good. You know what? Shout out to that brother because he threw himself into the line of fire. You yes. gotta understand that. Yes. Because they were trying to get at him too. Yeah. And he had to fend them off like, dude, this ain't that. Right. You know what I'm saying? Y'all right. need to get up off a of dude. You yes. know what I mean? So he, yes. he did, you know, provide a, a certain amount of cushion as far as time yes. before the, everybody else came in there and <laughs> yes. regulated. Definitely. And shout out to the brother. Man, you see the brother man jump off man, the boat? Man jumped off the boat. <laughs> I already was a young guy. Oh, yeah, 16 years yeah, 16. old. And uh, uh, Suplex King, by the way, he suplexed one of them, just pick him up and like, bam! You know what I'm saying? Just, you know what I mean? Ooh, just, woo. Yes. Yeah, yeah, he got in there, you know what I'm saying? I appreciate, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Before I start, though, yes. I just want to shout out to our cousin, LeVette. Um, she, uh, our cousin who lives in Chicago. Uh, she also has a Facebook where she has, uh, it's not a podcast, but only a program called Princess Hannah's Cafe. Hope I said it right, cuz. But anyway, I just kind of want to shout her out real quick because she what actually up, brought that out, brought Come that idea, <laughs> that brought that idea out for us to actually do it because my little brother didn't really, he, he wasn't really that excited to do it at yeah, first. Yeah, I wasn't going to do it. Because a, a lot of people has it circulating, yeah. like, you know what I'm saying, you know, or whatnot. But uh, I, I guess, you know, we're basically going to say the same thing, but we might say something else different, too, you know, that, yes. you know, yes. that, 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 that could be positive, you know, hopefully, you know, for uh, the situation that happened. Yes. You know, me personally, and I, I think you might feel the same about this, bro, uh, we were really glad to see the brothers sticking together, you know what I'm saying? De definitely, definitely. You know, just like I think a lot of black people were just like, you know, that, that, that was just uh, un uncalled for and cowardly. 
all them to do that. But, you know, it's never fun when the rabbit got the gun. And not at okay, all. Okay, so all. the rabbit got the gun and uh, they got scared. You yes. know what I mean? And, uh, you know, and shout out to uh, the folding chairs of America. You know what I mean? <laughs> Is that a prop? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I thought I'd throw it in there, you know. I, know. I mean, well, I I mean it, a they were using sound. folding chairs, <laughs> bopping people in the yeah, video. Yeah, folding yeah, chairs, yeah. I thought I'd bring mine, you know. Hey, listen, I'm strapped and ready, you know what I mean? Cocked and ready to go. Well, come over here with that. Hey. hey, this the real one, too. Hey, the Show first, up. hey, the brown one. Forget the white one. Yeah. I got the the hard brown one. It's all so steel. And old girl got socked with 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 uh, oh, one man. of the chairs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the, a couple the, people got socked. Yes, yeah, she yeah. was sitting on the floor. He was like, bow, bow, bow. Yeah. <laughs> one for you, one for you, and one for you. Like you know? with that game at Chuck E. Cheese with the <laughs> 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 I got you. <laughs> you know, man, but you know, I gotta say this though: the police, man, y'all need to do a better job about investigating something before you just start putting handcuffs on people. Start investigating first. Do your investigation first. See who was in the wrong first before you start putting handcuffs on people because they automatically started putting handcuffs on the black folks, and the white folks were still walking around. They were still walking around like, hey, you know, and everybody was saying, hey, it was them. It was mm. them. They started it. Arrest them. Put the cuffs on them. Well, well the dude that with, 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 with the uh, with the chair, the <laughs> folding chair, he, um, he actually did that in front of a cop. When he was bopping people with the folding chair, mm. there was a cop right there watching him do it. And then I guess after yeah. the, the second well, he victim. He couldn't arrest all No, 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 no. But, I, but, but like he, he arrested he him. He put handcuffs on him. Mm. You know, but he didn't do it aggressively. He was a brother, actually. That yeah. was a cop. Yep. You know, he's just like, okay, that's enough. He just grabbed him. He said, come <laughs> on, man. He cuffed him up and whatnot. But, you know, he... He kind of took his time before he put the handcuffs on it, <laughs> you know. You know what I'm saying? Listen, I, I just want to kind of say this, you know. Um, if you don't start, nothing won't be none. You know, just you got like like you said, Mo. Some of these people out here, and we're not gonna say every white person, but some of them feel really overly privileged to to do some 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 things that just are really stupid. Mm. You know, uh, that was a stupid thing to do. This man was a dock worker. He, he he was a person of authority for that dock, okay? That he had the authority to tell this 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 group of people to move their boat. They didn't like what was going on. They didn't want to move the boat. <coughs> and so some 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 uh jack in the box MF come and jumps out of the word work, you know, and so he can't fight. You know, you can see clearly see that, you know, he's attacking this dock worker though and but instead of the group saying grabbing the dude and say hey what you doing man don't you know what i mean they they jump in it they yeah. jump in it and, yeah. and so this this is the reason folks that a lot of people are just kind of celebrating this this turn of events that happened <laughs> with this incident because they cow they they they, they did some coward stuff and they jumped this 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 man this dock worker that was supposed to be there and had the right to tell them to move their boat, yeah. you know, and they did it as a family or whatever they, they are, you know what I'm saying? And so I don't know if they thought they were going to get away with it or whatnot. Obviously not because I mean, so many people were pissed off. I don't think anybody was more pissed off than that young man that jumped off that boat. <laughs> okay. And swam <laughs> over there at 16 years old. Of course, you know, with us, you know, we might be young, but we look older. You know, because yeah. that young man was tall. He looked yeah. like man. That's what but they But a young say. man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But he was only, what, they said only 16 years old. Yeah. And also, now, was that a signal that I, I heard from people on on doing the YouTube channel saying that when the security guard threw his hat in the air, like that was a signal for that he was being attacked or something? I, it I it might have. It. I don't know. Maybe <laughs> I looked at it where he was like, well, fuck this job. <laughs> yeah. That's how I looked, I looked at it. Fuck too. this job. I'm finna fight this dude. You know, because, you know, hey, listen, well, most people, but most people, when they're on a job, the job always tell you to not retaliate. You know what I'm saying? They always tell you that. Don't retaliate. Even you know if you're being attacked. Even if you're being attacked, which I think is a real asinine rule of policy because, listen, I'm going to get fired too. 
Okay. Mm -hmm. But yes, after I get done, I'm going to get a lawyer and I'm going to sue that company because I was being attacked and I have the right to defend myself. Right. Okay. So when that dude threw his hat up in the air, I looked at it as, well, fuck this job. I'm going to go ahead and, and get busy with this dude. You know what I mean? Because he's attacking me. Right. You know right. what I'm saying? So enough. So enough. Yeah, but I mean, I mean, it, there was more to that, to that video. I mean, yeah. whereas after they seen, okay, especially when they seen the, the young boy, young man that jumped off that boat and went over there. Because it was only a couple of them that at first that was really helping the dock worker. Yes. I think after they seen the other surrounding black folks seen that, then you see a group of three, a group of four, and more yeah. people coming down. Me and like, okay, come on, let's just get it out. And you it know, was just shocking was, people. Yeah. You know what I mean? People just, off the boat. Off the yes, you yes, off, yes, yes, yeah. yes. So they went over there just shocking people. So it just turned all 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 right. All outright riot, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Well, right, right, <laughs> or, or a massacre, really, because they really, they, that I know, I don't think they expected that that no, response. No, not at all. I, I think if not they did, they would never have done what they've done. No, but I, no, but no. I think that's just the mentality that you was talking about. Yeah, where they just think they can get away with certain things and certain and stuff and certain things are not going to be. Done about it. Right. I can whoop on this on this black dude. Black man. Yeah. In front of y'all. While y'all watch. And y'all ain't gonna do a damn y'all y'all gonna protest. Right, yeah, yeah, you're gonna march. You're gonna march, you're gonna get angry, you're gonna tear up your own stores in your own neighborhoods. Yeah. Ain't gonna be no retaliation on me. Right. Well <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> Surprise! You know? Surprise. Hey, and I wanna go ahead before we end this clip. Uh, that apparently, not in the video that you sent me, there was a, a group of sisters that went out there paying homage to the ancestors uh, in this same area. Because right before was, this happened, right? Yes, a couple of hours. Yeah, this was an area known to be uh, heavy for uh, slave, slave trading. auctioning. Yeah, auctioning. Yeah, yeah, slave trading and whatever. Yeah. yeah. So you're right. You're right. Yep. Yeah. And I mean, hell, for this to happen, you know what I'm saying, the same day. Man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You're what right. the sis say in the video was like, uh, you know, talking about how the ancestors answered the call, you know. Oh, right, saying? right. Yeah, they answered the call. <laughs> We're tired of this shit. You know what I mean? This is re redemption. <laughs> right, right. Fuck all light them candles and shit, dude. We're going to bust some candles over the head. All lives matter. Right, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. with that being said, bro, did you have anything that you wanted to add? Well, I just, you know, I just really clip. just want to just say, you know, kudos for the for, for for all the brothers and sisters out there that stuck yeah. together, you know, because it's been kind of hard for us to really kind of do that, especially in our own communities, you know what I mean? <sighs> We're too busy at each other, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, I like that that show solidarity, you know, between, you know, the black race that was down there, you know, African Americans yeah. that were down there, and whatnot. Uh, the situation w was messed up, mm. you know. Uh, but again, like I said, you know, these people had it coming. They, you know, when you look for trouble, you'll find it. And uh, you know, I again, I just gotta say, they did not expect the response that they got from it. And hopefully, you know, uh, this is uh, life changing for them. Okay, that uh, they know that's not acceptable to put right. your hands on people because you don't want to follow the rules. Yeah, okay? and the whole world seen it. And the whole world seen that you guys were wrong right. and that you uh, got dealt with. So, yes, that's all yes. I have. And I want to say shout out to the creators of They Clone Tyrone. Now, if y'all haven't seen that movie already, Go ahead, go into Netflix and type in They Clone Tyrone, okay? Now, why are you bringing that up? Now, in the movie, there's a scene where the the brothers band together to go against this white man, the, this, these white right, folks yeah, 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 that, yeah, that, yeah. that was 
working on uh, destroying them. Yeah. Right, with yeah. the with like with the with the, the chicken, food, with the food, and everything. Yeah. yeah, the hair products, the hair products. Yeah. yeah, and that's all true story. Yeah, you know, so they put it in a movie for our entertainment, but they show you what they do with. And right. so the fact that they came together, the brothers, even though they was at odds ends, that they was mm. enemies, right. they came together for for a common purpose. Right. You know, and, right? And I get what you're saying because they're they're putting it, people. They're putting this stuff right in your face <laughs> because, like my brother said, it's strictly for entertainment. But it's actually some truth to it because a lot of movies, a lot of myths, legends, so on and so forth. There's truth to start it off in the beginning. Yes. You know what I mean? So it's just like, okay, what was the devil's biggest trick? Well, to make people believe he don't exist. Yeah. So what's the best way to do it by putting it right in your face, face and you don't even see it? Ooh. Good job, Mo. Good job, Mo. I get it. Yeah. Good you got it. You got it. <laughs> you got it. Man. You got that breakdown. I, that, that was, I couldn't have said it any better. Well, y'all, hey, y'all heard the dialogue. Uh, if you lasted this long through the videos, kudos to yes. you. Go ahead, hit that like button and subscribe. Uh, if you haven't already, and until the next video, you all... Oh, and comment, comment. Leave a comment in the comment section below. And, and yeah, just because we might not get a lot of comments a lot of times, we get a lot of views, though. Hey. Just want to throw that in there. There uh, you go. For some of the naysayers. So. <laughs> anyway. That's so, it. So, with that being said, you guys, peace. Peace. peace.